Hi, Frank here, Springer's Adventures, coming at you from Persimmon Hollow in Deland, Florida. One of our other favorite brewery stops here. Uh, it's only about 35, 40 minutes, 45 minutes, I guess, from Ocala. Nice ride between Ocala and Daytona, so if you're coming over for Daytona Bike Week, you just sit right down 92 to hit the Deland and uh, Persimmon Brewery. Great little brewery. Uh, they always got great beer, great place, great space old building it's really a neat building so uh, let's go inside and check it out so uh, as you can see we walk around they have plenty of tables places to sit down I have a nice little bar area in here as well there's the bartenders behind the bar uh, let's see we got the chalkboard up there on the left hand right in front of you there that tells you all the different brews they got going on today along with some limited releases it gives you the price uh, for an eight ounce glass or whatever size glass it's going to be and also the price of growlers they do fill up uh, growlers there if you do not have a crowler machine so bring your old glass growler I'm a fan of those anyway so uh, there you go they uh, do sell knickknacks t-shirts uh, tins stickers all that good stuff as well uh, pretty nice little bar area there so we'll just kind of pan around show you the inside of this place uh, there's uh, they got TVs up there memorabilia on the walls there they got some uh, barrels they do do some barrel ages from time to time uh, there's a couple of the barrels there they got some uh, brew in their building. Uh, there's where the magic happens in the background. It's a it's a really good sized brewery, as you can tell. Uh, so they I mean they got uh, they got quite a th the big thing going on in there. They were actually working in there, uh, doing some brewing that day. That light's coming through almost blinds you there. But uh, as you can see, it's not a small operation. They they do got some good sized tanks going on in there. So uh, they do all their they do canning and everything in house as well. So uh, they do have uh, they have quite a few different beers that they can from time to time. I'm just going to pan back through there again. Uh, they got a couple little old video machines and stuff like that. They got music. They got a pool table. Uh, like I said, just really cool old space in there. Uh, there's some t-shirts up on the walls. Our beer for the day was going to be, my wife had the uh, a, a, a porter. It's a chocolate porter. I think it's called Three Wise Guys. And then I had a double block. Uh, very good beer. Both of them very good. So uh, just going to walk around a little bit more on the inside there. Just show you what it looks like. Uh, Thought that was a pretty neat little table. I actually have one of those at home like that. Got a wall of stickers there from different people brought in from different breweries. Uh, there's some of the tins and everything like that up there. People dropped off there. There's the, where the restrooms are. You're going to get a kick out of this one, especially if you're a guy. There you go. A urinal made out of a beer keg. How good is that? So uh, on the before we left, we decided to bring some cans home there for the day. They're uh, cans for the day. What you do is if you bought uh, beer each, then you could buy a case of beer for $28, mix and match. So, I mean, it's just a little hairle over a dollar a piece. And then we also brought uh, a, a growler of that chocolate porter, a 64-ounce growler. Well, I hope you enjoyed that uh, going over there to Persimmon Brewery today. It's a really uh, cool little spot if you really enjoy it. And uh, like I said, if you're a uh, fan of blondes, I mean, uh, the beer, the blonde beer, that's a really good one. I've always enjoyed that. And for all of us that got a little bit of hippie still left in us, that Beach Hippie is an IPA. That's a really good beer too. So, again, thanks for tooling around with me today. Have any questions? Leave them below. Shoot me a comment. Uh, as, as always, give me a thumbs up. Subscribe if you like what you see. And uh, we'll catch you out on the road. Take care.